Hey guys, what's up today? Uh, it's my first iPod video because I just got my iPod Touch um, ge fourth generation one day ago, and uh, today I'm just going to show you the best games and apps that I have on my iTouch. So yeah, the first game I'm going to uh, show you is Fruit Ninja. So the point of this game is that uh, you need to slide and cut fruit, and you have to uh, and you have to avoid cutting the bomb. So uh, if you lose a fruit, you lose a life. It's pretty hard because I'm looking at the chance, and you can also share your score on Facebook, your leaderboard, which is um, I guess it's game center, and uh, you can retry. And I'm quitting. So yeah. So the next app I'm going. To show you is water slide. It's pretty good. So the point of this game is that uh, you are actually on a water slide, and you need to use your you need to use the sensors um, to move around and new game. So here's your guy. You need to move your. You only use your sensors, and here's the break, the red thing. If you fall down three times, you lose your life. Uh, this, and uh, the further you go, it gets harder. So, so yeah, this is water slide. Yeah, so this is pretty good game. The next app, actually it's not a game, it's an app, it's called a PS Express, which is right here. And if you guys love editing um, photos like me, you can, uh, you will really love this app, because it's just like um, a great editing program on your iPod Touch, uh, but it's simple to use. So I'll just select a photo. This app is pretty good, so uh, what, what, uh, you, what you can do is that you can add different uh, effects, you can add borders, you can totally edit to your photo and as well as you can pop it too so uh, I'll just go and add an effect so um, see this is a pop effect vintage blur Wolverine and black and white so yeah these are all the effects that you can get you can also add custom borders or you can say frames around the photo you want yeah, so if I press OK, go add a photo. And you can adjust the exposure saturation tint, you can make it black and white, and you can also adjust the contrast. You can also, uh, yeah, you can also sharpen it. You just need to move your finger to sharpen it. And now you can press OK, and uh, if you want, you can crop it like this. If you want this, uh, this area of the picture, you can just crop it and press OK. So the thing will crop this, and you can also change it to a sketch photo like it's been sketched, and move your finger around to check how it's sketched and the sketch. And you can also get another feature with a soft focus. This is kind of awesome because it blurs everything else and focuses on uh, something which you want. Or so yeah, I'll, I'll just go ahead and save it. And you can also share it. Yes, you can also share it. And uh, now the next game which I'll show you guys is, is, is called Doodle Jump. You guys might know it, but for some people who don't know it, it's just a game here you need to say this doodle and uh, use uh, your phones or iPod sensors to save this guy. This app is old, but still one of the best apps in App Store. So yeah, I'll, I'll just go out of this one. I'll remove the background apps, and uh, now I'll now the next game is Paper Toss. So this game is pretty good, in, uh, in this game what you guys uh, have to do is that I, I'll just choose easy and this is a paper and the dustbin, you need to put this paper in the bin and there is a fan so you need to throw it according to the air pressure so that it goes in there. Well, if it's 85 I'll pretty much throw it straight. 
to go. And also you can go to main menu and there are other levels like airport, basement, you, here you go, you, you, you go to airport. You can also go to street, I, I love this one straight, it looks awesome, the graphics are just awesome for this game. Alright, so uh, the next game. So the next game is Need for Speed Hot Pursuit. So you guys uh, already know what is Need for Speed. Yeah, so uh, what you need to do in this game is that uh, you can be a cop or a racer. So if you're a cop, you need to take down the enemy, the racer, and or if you are a racer, you need to evade the cops. So this is just an intro video. You can see the graphics are pretty good. So, yeah. So I'll just do a quick race like this. You can also play multiplayer if uh, you have a friend sitting next to you. Oh, Alright, let's get carried this one. Okay, yeah, it can be a cop. So what you need to do is that you, I, I need to take down the enemy or the racer that is trying to eva evade. The controls, are, the controls are pretty simple. When you go, you can slide your finger for lifeless. Good. And for break, you need to put your finger down. Yeah, so I, I can just slide the finger to go here. And uh, you can go back to apply the brakes and use this. It's pretty hard to play because I'm looking at the camera. Go ahead and try this game because this, is, this game is pretty good and it has great graphics. Let's go out of this game. Okay, things ain't always what they seem or cracked up to be. Like all these faking ass rappers in this industry. Talking about what they can do. The next app is. Angry Birds. Yeah, these days this game is very popular in App Store, and the point of this game is that you have a bunch of Angry Birds which uh, you have to control and you have to destroy the enemy. I'll just put on this level like this. So these are the enemies, and these are your birds. With these birds, you get there. All of them have their special powers. You can also change the room. So I'll just show a bird. There you go. Like this one, the yellow one has a special capability to go really fast if you press one. There you go. And this now I have one left, so I have to take down this guy with this, or I have another chance. All right, so I missed it now. I just zoom in. I have one guy left, and I have to take down that enemy, or else I lose. So. Yeah, as you, you, can, you guys can see that I lost, alright, so... This is it, it like it failed. <laughs> alright, so, uh... Alright, so the, I think this is pretty much it, and... If you guys like my video, and if you want more uh, videos from my side about iPod Touch, and about the teams, Winterboard team, and all those tutorials, please subscribe, rate, and comment. Avoid putting bad comments uh, down below, because this is my first video about iTouch and it just got it yesterday so I don't know much about these iPhone so just be nice. Right? So bye and cheers.